Hi, welcome, Simon here, and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'd like to walk you through step by step on how to add additional NVMe M.2 solid state drive. So here I have the NVMe SSD drive, and I'll be adding them as a secondary on top of the primary NVMe was already pre-installed in this gaming laptop. All right, so here is the Asus laptop and let me show it to you the model number. So if you turn it around, take a look at the back of your laptop. As you can see, the model says FX506L. Okay, all you need to have is just a regular Phillips screwdriver and I'll be using an electric screwdriver here in this uh, video demonstration. Let me go ahead and start unscrew the back cover. So just go ahead and remove the screws and they are just a regular Phillips screws. The screws right in the top center is the longest and the rest of other screws are the same except the one at the bottom left corner. So you're going to know the difference and make sure you do not mix match your screws. So here at the bottom left corner, as you can see that the screw is a lot shorter, tiny screw, and that is the only one at the bottom left corner. And the one on the bottom right corner here, the screw does not come off. And once you start hearing this screw that clicks, click, 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 that means uh, you already unscrew it, just leave it as this. The reason why the screw does not come off is just because the screw pushes out the back cover allows you to use a plastic prying tool, stick in between the plastic and allows you to pry it open. Okay, as you can see, I'm prying it up, making a gap on the back cover here. You just wanna work around the laptop until you can lift it up. Okay, so just lift up the back cover, simple as that and there you have it so just on a side note if you're interested upgrading the ram here is my upgraded ram this is the original ram that comes with the laptop eight gigabytes i make a separate video to upgrade the ram up to 16 gigabytes so it's eight and eight that is 16 gigs of ram if you're interested on how to upgrade the ram Go ahead and check out the link down description below or at the end of the video i'll post it somewhere here or maybe here where you can go check it out all right let's talk about the nvme m2 ssd drive this is the hard drive that we are trying to upgrade add additional to it so the original one is already here which is on the left let's go ahead and remove it So you just need to remove that screw and this is just the uh, the sleeve that goes in okay and you can slide the hard drive to your left to remove it and this is the 512 gigabyte NVMe M2 so that's the original and now I need to look for my screws there you go okay so that is for the original hard drive so in this laptop there are two slots so let me go ahead and put it back here the second slot as you can see is the bottom right corner so what you want to do is get yourself a Phillips screwdriver remove that screw okay do not lose that screw and go ahead and slide in your NVMe M2 so once you slide it in at 45 degree angle to the left and go ahead and tighten up that screw that you just removed. Now the computer would have two NVMe M2 SSD drive. Now the hard drive is brand new and it's blank. You need to go into disk management to initialize the hard drive and format the hard drive before you can start using it. 
All right. So what you want to do is you want to let me go ahead and get this thing set up back again. Do not want to disturb the original M2 drive. So let's go ahead and put that screw back in, which I just removed as a demonstration. Okay, so that is that is good. Now, um, what you want to do next is to go ahead and get the back cover, go back in. Very straightforward. All you have to do is just close the gap. Okay, press it down. It's just like a clipper. It clips it all the way down. Press it all around the laptop. You can hear the little click, click, click. Okay, and then have all the screws in. And go ahead and fasten the screw by using a Phillips screwdriver. So if you're not sure where to buy the uh, NVMe M2, please go check the link down in the description below. I'll list them where you can where I will direct you to either Amazon or eBay where you can buy directly from them. Okay. Um, okay. So um, okay, just go ahead and tighten up all the screws here. And if you do find this video is helpful, please give me a like smash the like button give me a thumbs up i really appreciate you for doing that and if you haven't subscribed to the channel please feel free to subscribe and again i was going to tell you is that um, if you're interested to upgrade your laptop ram and which i did upgrade to 16 gigs go ahead and check out the video maybe here or here i'll link it down for you or maybe in the down description below um, go check it out and i'll walk you through how to upgrade additional RAM to your laptop. Now, one of the thing I like to point it out to you is this USB adapter. What it does is um, it allows you to extract the data. Um, so what I earlier mentioned was upgrading a secondary drive, but for you, if you're interested to uh, grab the data or whatnot, imagine this is the uh, NVMe M2 drive and you can stick it in, put a little screw here, holding it down. And this adapter pretty much is acting like a, a USB flash drive. You can just stick it into your laptop and you can recover your data. So for those of you who um, having problem with the original C drive, if you're getting a blue screen or the Windows registry corrupted and you need to extract the data, go ahead and check out this USB adapter. I'll link it down below. I got this from Amazon. Uh, it's a very good tool that allows you to extract the data. All right, thanks for watching. Until next time, uh, bye now.